All right, so I finally found some basketball wax. All I've been seeing lately has been baseball, football, hockey. Finally, uh, some basketball to open. So I've seen these being, being open now on YouTube. So let's try it out. We've got the Patini, Patini Contenders draft picks. Uh, it says uh, one auto per box on average. So let's see how that goes. Box number one. We've got front row Precious Achu Achua. This looks more substantial thicker. That was Mascot the handle is Arizona State. You wouldn't want to grab that and swing it all day long. It was quite a handle. We've got a prospect. Oh, he's a base so card. Like, oh, is the exactly green numbered? No, I think it's just the color. I'm just trying to figure out what's what. I'm not really sure what's a base card and what's uh We got Alonzo Ball in here though. I know, I've heard of him, so Alonzo Ball. Pretty sure those are just base cards though. Like I said, I've only seen this being opened once. Just trying to see if there's numbers on here. I know some of them are numbered. Oh, here's an autograph. So I'll show that. The Jalen Smith, rookie auto. So that's the one per box, I'm guessing. Just gonna. So I know some of these are numbered. I'm just trying to see. They all look the same to me. They're all prospect tickets. I'm guessing those are just the prospect ticket. I'm guessing are the base cards. Winning ticket, Al Horford. I'm guessing that's a. So that's all right. You get five autos. It's not a bad deal. We start pulling up some really impressive timbers. These were cut by hand. This should be original work. Check this out. It's hard to see. They all look very similar. Yeah. Look at that thing, sir. So I'm guessing this is different. This is a front row seat, Jaden McDaniels. I mean, that's not a modern design. That is really old. That's all. Prospect ticket, CJ McCollum. Yeah, yeah. Almost interlocked into the back. Yeah, that's all. 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 Yeah, Red parallel, maybe? It's not numbered, though. Pascal Siakam. So maybe that's what it is. Let me just see. Those are all silvers. Okay. Don't see any numbered cards yet, so... They all look the same, really. This feels like a memorabilia card. It's pretty thick. Even I'd be very curious about the dendrochronology on that. If those are older than 1795, we have to really think about so we've got a Jeremy Lamb winning ticket. So I'm just going to put all the prospect tickets together and guess if the other ones are different. So this is another front row seat, Vernon Carey Jr. Pretty sure the numbers are in the front. It's the only red parallel I see. First time opening this product, so just trying to learn what I'm looking for. Let's 
So these red parallels aren't numbered. So front row seat, red parallel, Cole Anthony. You can see it's red. With the Pascal Siakam. Usually when the ones at the end are flipped over, there's number numbered, so. And you've got a Duke Blue Devil mascot. I'll have to look later. See what their what the base cards are. Obviously the red parallels are clearly different. So here's a James Harden red parallel. Game ticket. And this is a Josh Hart winning ticket. Richard Hamilton, UConn winning ticket. Got a Obi Topin, draft 2020 class. By your government health insurance. Like prescription drugs, dental and vision care, physiotherapists, chiropractors, online mental health therapy, and more. With SureHealth from GSC. SureHealth plans protect you from health care costs not covered by your government health insurance. All right, so that's it for the first box. Put that aside. So we got the first box. I'll have to look and see what, what else I got, but obviously the, the main hit is the Jalen Smith Auto. That's the first box. All right, it's box number two. Got a Bradley Beal game ticket. Red parallel. Oh, yeah. Jerry, you got your brush. Zion Williamson. Prospect that ticket. We got another. Pretty sure I got a winning ticket from Al Horford before. Back number two. Freddie Gillespie, game ticket, Baylor. Sparky the Sun Devil. Arizona State mascot. This was meant to last. So, five hours. 
this pack we've got a Ty Jerome winning ticket. Another precious Achua front row seat. Got a Killian Hayes front row seat. Ren Carey Jr. front row seat. This one's just a regular, the other one is a red parallel. There was numbered cards in here. It's not. Maybe they're only in a certain amount of packs. Got a Chris Middleton, a uh, red parallel. Another draft 2020 class, Obi Topin. Josh Hart winning ticket. Next time I'm gonna look at the checklist online before I open it. So I don't really know what I'm looking for. Obviously the autos and the main things that I'm looking for. Parallels. Obviously the winning ticket is uh, the obvious uh, insert. So DeAndre Hunter. And a James Wiseman draft 2020 class. So let's try box number three. So far, we're averaging and we're getting an autograph per box, so that's a good. I'm excited for that. Got an Isaac Okoro front row seat. Bill Russell winning ticket. That's cool. An auto, Ray Sean Hammonds, Georgia.
Might have to make a video of the hits after, besides the autographs and the obvious inserts. I'm not really sure what's uh, the big cards in here. Parallels in there. Rookies are the obvious ones. We got a Ben Simmons uh, red parallel. We know it was placed like this because the drill went through it. Gives us some construction details. Magic Johnson winning ticket. That's pretty cool. They got the veterans, the Hall of Famers, and the draft picks in there. Pingo, Jerry, look at this. It's a uh, Markapalooza. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. Markapalooza. Well, that is fantastic. Yeah, that is great. Boy, we have got more markets. How about that? We've got a DeAndre Hunter winning ticket. James Wiseman, draft 2020 class. Coming to life. Lost for these 200 years. Here he is, right now. That's a very anomalous what occurred in that RF1 with that Roman Duma. Those timbers are not associated with the head shaft, not associated with the chapel shaft. That is for sure. They're much older. They're much different. We've not seen the light in the money pit. That's important. Got a Josh Hart winning ticket, red parallel. Patrick yes. Williams, so, front row seat. Kemba Walker, or Kemba Walker, game ticket, red parallel. That's an interesting one right there. Marks on that one. Can't really see the red too well. But it is a red parallel. I don't think anyone's ever been deeper in the money pit than the 113, 114 feet. That works well, sir. Yeah, yeah. Anything below that, it's really interesting. That should be where we can find something to real value. Got a Devin Dodson, front row seat. Jerry West, winning ticket. All right, so let's open box number four. Tyrese Maxey, draft 2020 class from Kentucky. Got a Kareem Abdul Jabbar winning ticket. There's the auto. It is Xavier Sneed. And we've got a Tony Delk winning ticket. Got a Drew Holiday game ticket red parallel. Alex Levine and Craig Castor travel 
Got a Tyrese Halliburton front row seat. Got a Hakeem Olajuwon winning ticket. This is found in an area about 120 feet down. Well, this uh, hand forged bar, three quarter inches, very fibrous. And we've got a Kansas Big J mascot. Wear mark is basically on one side. Yeah. So that tells me that it was sort of anchored into the wall of a rock formation or a clay or whatever. Maybe this part was in the wall, this is out. Yes, these would be driven into the uh, roof of the wall of the cave. And then uh, liners or other working equipment like hoist and pulleys would be anchored on this here. Not into timbers? I don't think so, not this particular item. No. Got a Ray Allen winning ticket, Red Parallel. 120 feet deep in the location the team believes to be the original money pit. James Wiseman, front row seat. Might it have been used to place the treasure there itself? What kind of data are you putting on this? Got a Jimmy Butler a game ticket, red parallel. Okay. Because it's short, we were wondering, would that make a difference? Of Tyrese Halliburton winning ticket. I think I've got that one already. It's definitely in a tunnel or a cave or some type of thing like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It was used in an enclosure. Okay. Yeah. But an enclosure could be a shaft itself, yeah. too. Okay. Yeah. Last pack of the fourth box. We've got Florida Gator Al named Albert, <laughs> mascot. This is the teardrop anomaly that we're getting close to. It's probably interesting to talk about it. RJ Hampton, front row seat. So like I said, I'm going to have to go through these after to figure out. Because they all look similar, just different colors. They're all prospect tickets. I'm guessing those are all base cards. So last box of 2020 Panini Contenders draft picks. Let's hope we keep the streak of pulling one autograph per box. Maybe two would be nice. Udoko Azubuike. I uh, probably butchered that. Rookie auto. And we've got Nick Richards front row seat. Got right, a Kevin Love game ticket, red parallel. We've got Smokey from Tennessee.
for effect and relief, plus a cooling flavor sensation. Vapor complete with Vicks Vapor Cool. The vaporizing daytime coughing, aching power through your day medicine. Now the dad here pretending to be a horse. Notice how these stains are not make the leak. Uh, so Isaac Coro, Auburn University. Draft 2020 class. And a Gail Goodrich winning ticket, UCLA. Including a blend of botanicals and melatonin that supports your sleep cycle. So you can seize the morning. See both here. They say money doesn't grow on trees. Work hard, but don't work stupid. They forgot to tell the boss. I need the money. I'm going to get this log until I can get money out. Got a Nico Mannion, Arizona Wildcats, front row seat. Red parallel. We turn oh, yeah. got a Christian Leitner winning ticket. I got a Kevin Durant game ticket red parallel. We've got a Tyrese Maxey front row seat. Got the last auto out of this. I think it's separated. I think it's in the stack. Maybe not. These are all base cards except for the top. Sure, I got one autograph per box. There it is, right at the bottom. <laughs> All right. I knew it wasn't losing. I knew I had five for one for each box. Said on average, so some boxes might have more than one. This one is. Auto the Orange from Syracuse University. Nice. We've got uh, winning ticket Ray Allen from UConn. What's that? Does it look like? It looks like rope, actually. Yeah, a little piece of rope. Pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. And the last pack of box number five. Drum roll. Oh, there we go. Finally. And off on a hit. Uh, before I go to get to the big hit, we'll go, we'll start off with the front row seat, LaMelo Ball. So that's a good one too. Don't have many sleeves left. I'll have to grab some from the storage unit, but definitely going to sleeve this puppy up. Got a Magic Johnson winning ticket. And it's definitely... Some sort of parallel. It is numbered 21 out of 23. Definitely going to be sleeving that up right away. What a what a way to finish. Boom, that's a boom right there. Magic Johnson. Been nice if it had been autographed, but still, numbered at 23, 21 out of 23. I'm happy with that. So five autographs and a Magic Johnson. Uh, I don't know, parallel or I don't know what you would call this. I'm just getting back into the card game, so doesn't really stay on here. Anyways, it's a sick card, and that's getting saved up right away. And the rest of these look like base cards. So, like I said, I'm gonna check out online to see what cards are uh, 
B. I'm, I'm guessing all the prospect tickets are all B. I didn't see any numbered cards, so these are all prospect. So a lot of Bs. And all the, and all the inserts are there, and then the five autographs. So not a bad uh, five boxes. So happy with that. Uh, not really familiar with the draft picks of some of those guys, um, but I'm sure they'll eventually be good, and I'll be glad that I have them. So, uh, Especially with the Magic Johnson, everybody knows who he is, so a numbered card for him at a 23, especially if that's gem in 10, would be awesome. So, yeah, uh, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below, let me know what you thought uh, the best card was in here. Uh, let me know if you guys are more basketball fans. I'm more so baseball, hockey. Um, I do, obviously, Raptors. But uh, not so much with the prospects and NCAA uh, up and coming uh, prospects and draft picks. So, yeah, just let me know, comment, and uh, give me some feedback. I appreciate it. Thanks for watching, guys, and have a good night.